I purchased this comforter from Burlington. It looks like this. It's got little mermaids and stuff. It's a size twin, but I really, really liked the comforter and I was like, I don't even care if it doesn't go like on both sides, like equally the same size. It's just such a pretty print. Um, and this was $34.99. But it's just so freaking beautiful. Let me show it to you. I already put it on her bed. Isn't it? gorgeous i am literally so obsessed with this i think it's absolutely beautiful and as you can see it does go pretty low on this side but on this side it barely fits but you can't even tell because it's against the wall so if you see a comforter that you like and you have a full-size bed and it's a twin you can totally totally buy it and totally use it um but your bed is just gonna have to be against the wall so you can't see the other side but i mean you can also save a little bit of money because the twin typically is a little bit cheaper than the full size so just a little tip there but isn't it absolutely beautiful i'm so obsessed with it i also purchased this little rolling three-tier cart from Burlington and I am organizing some stuff too but I really really wanted one of these to organize all of my hair stuff and I had seen one at Burlington that was pink for $40 but this little rolling cart was only $12.99 from Burlington and I could not believe it so I decided to put all my little hair stuff in here like my hair blow dryers and then I have a curling wand and then another curling wand some headbands and hair accessories and then up here I have my hair products these little sequin bins are from the Dollar Tree I have little hair clips in this little bin that I got from Dollar Tree as well. And then this is a little Eiffel Tower thing that I got from Daiso and I have like my hair brushes and my round brushes. So I really, really love how this looks. It's got the rolling, it is a rolling cart so you can move it around. And I'm just in love with it guys. What do you guys think? I can't believe this was only $12.99. I had seen a white one at Dee Dee's Discounts, but that one was just white. So I wanted a teal or a pink one. And I can't believe I found this one for only $12.99. Considering the pink one that I'd seen that might have been a little bit skinnier and like maybe half the size of this and maybe a little bit taller. But that one was $40. So I just think... This is perfect and I really love how the little Dollar Tree sequin bins look in here. And yeah, I'll have to show you the packaging that it came with. And I'm organizing some of the makeup and stuff. And I'm always organizing this room. <laughs> this room's constantly a mess, but I try to find ways to help me stay organized. And I knew my hair stuff was like everywhere. So I'm hoping that this will be just a little bit more effective um, for me when it comes to all my hair stuff. So I really love that. What do you guys think? You guys are going to have to let me know how it looks and if you like it or not. I went ahead and added this shelf here. Um, and then up here I am using those Dollar Tree bins. And I just have a bunch of random things like pencil bags, um, notepads, sticky notes, jewelry bags and containers, tape and glue, stuff like that. And then over here, I have some of my mermaid signs. This Hello Kitty, um, some, a subscriber sent to me. So thank you so much if you still watch my videos. <laughs> 
And then I have the sequin bins, um, a little journal, um, just random things. And then I have my calendar, random pens, um, these that I got from the Dollar Tree are holding some notepads. My One of my planners is right here, my Dollar Tree planner. And then these I got from the 99 cent store. So I'm using that to organize like my little notepads and stuff. These are little highlighters that a subscriber sent to me. They're like in the shape of a nail polish. Isn't that so cute? But they're highlighters. These a uh, subscriber sent to me. They're little Hello Kitty sticky notes page flags, these unicorns are erasers. I have washi tape. I'm still kind of going through it and then I have gel pens down there. I have a bunch of sticky notes here and I'm using these little storage things from the Dollar Tree that I'm using to organize my lipsticks. So I use those here as well. And then I have more little sticky notes and stuff like that. And here I still kind of have a mess, but I'll show you guys anyway. I have some stickers in here. These are more stickers, but I... I store them in binders and then I have extra notepads and um, notebooks, journals, things like that that I'm able to find at the dollar stores. So I have those. I try to label them but this these labels keep falling off so I don't know. I have my washi tape in here. These are from the 99 cent store and I really love how that ended up looking. So I have two more in case my washi collection keeps growing. And then I have gift bags in here. And envelopes in here. And I think these are just like little folders and things like that. So that's this thing, which I want to paint like a pink color. This I got from Goodwill for like $5, I think, both of them together. I honestly can't remember, but I love those. That's a little peek at my current planner area, and I really, really love it. So just wanted to share that with you guys do a little haul. I went to this store. Where is it? It's called Waldo's and I was in TJ. I love to go down there um, to the Mercado Hidalgo where there's like a little coffee shop. I love going there. So I was down there and we went to the store and I thought, oh, this is kind of like a Dollar Tree, but it was more like a 99 cent store because not everything was a dollar. So, I didn't buy too many things, but I'll show you what I got. I got these crayons for Leilani. And they just look like this. I don't know how much they were because it doesn't have a price. Um, but I think it was like super cheap, guys. This stuff was like super inexpensive. I also got a spray bottle for my hair stuff. I have a whole hair station, so I'm going to put that there. I got these little cotton pads and it says it's 100% cotton and I don't know I figured I'd give those a shot it's got 60 pieces so I picked those up I also wanted to try these they have honey in them so I figured I would give those a shot they're little makeup wipes you get 30 pieces in here. They look pretty small. 
And then this one is in strawberry and oatmeal. I thought that, I don't know, that just sounded pretty amazing. So I figured I could try these. And they also come 30 pieces and it says it's, you know, a makeup remover um, for all skin types. So yeah, um, I went there really quickly. So if you guys would like to see more of this store, let me know because I could go down there and you know, um, show you guys around the store. Um, again, it's called Waldo's.